Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Pro staff in the house, but 6'1", not 95, 100. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so coffee sponsor of today is Chase. Chase is actually one of my coffee members. So Chase buys me a coffee once a month um, as part of the Buy Me A Coffee Club on the Tennis Spin channel. Uh, if you want to do the same and be a member or just take care of my coffee of the day, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. If you want to just hook us up and maybe contribute some to the channel, super thanks is the way. Click on the link below and we'll get you going. All right. Thank you so, so much. All right. Good brew today. Still nice and hot. All right. So pro staff in the house. They brought back the 61100. I feel like this was a Wilson exclusive for a little while, probably the last two, three years. They had a white racket that was just like this about 10, 12 years ago. There was a pretty big following for that racket, actually. I wasn't a big fan of it because I felt like it needed to be heavier. At 10.8 before strings, I thought that it didn't have much coming through. But apparently enough of you wanted it back that they actually listened, which they usually don't. So thank you for listening, Wilson, <laughs> to the people who support you and want you to make good rackets. Um, so they brought it back. In the new cosmetic, they're calling it 6.1. Version 14. The signature PWS thing, even though they don't promote it anymore on the sides. What does PWS mean? Perimeter weighting system. So they add weights to three and nine to balance it out, add more weight to the head, stabilize the center of the racket, making it plow through easier. All right. We, if we didn't have PWS, we would just add lead to three and nine. Okay. So it's essentially weight there. Um, I wonder if this thing will actually play like the uh, white one from back in the day. Let's that, that 12 points headlight is the thing that actually, you know, screams at me right now. Oh, it's like, it's a little too headlight, but let's see what the coaches think. All right, let's go out to the court and see uh, who's available to play with it. See you on the court. 6'1", 100. Perfect. Let's just, let's just go with Chris. Let's go with Chris here. Okay. Hey, go Chris, Chris, what do you think? Go. What do you think, Chris? Uh, this racket is the lighter version of the ones that are coming out here. I don't particularly uh, like the color of it. I think it's a bit too glossy. But I You said that already. I did. But <laughs> this racket itself is, I think, good for as someone who's uh, being introduced to the Pro Staff line. It's a really good light racket for those juniors who want to play with it a bit more. 
Um, again, it's not as stiff as like the 97, um, but the, you know, the head size makes it a little bit more forgiving. So this is a good racket I would pass on to that club player and junior player to try it out for, to introduce it in the pro staff line. Um, no, overall, uh, for a hundred racket of the six, uh, six one, sorry. Um, uh, I think this is their second one, right? They made, they made the other they made version. one before. Yeah, they made one before. Yeah. Um, it is a better update. I would say it's a little bit better than the previous one. Paint job, of course, is different. Um, yeah, like I, look, look, Coach Chris said, it was a, tailored to a player that is still within the 100 realm, um, but who's our juniors and maybe club players. It's easier power, of course, because um, due to his overhead overall head size. Um, the flex on this is mo probably the most flex out of the family, um, so that's why you get that nice, easy power. Um, but <clears throat> overall, I would say a good update, really good um, feel and power throughout the whole racket of, of an 100 pro staff. All right. Thank you. So, Shane, get your butt over here. So we were talking about Sorry, he's in the bathroom break the again. color, since Coach Chris doesn't like the new colors of this thing. I and, don't know. He just does not like chocolate, I guess. And we all agreed that the color reminds us of a dining, dining room, table. room table or a coffee table. Uh -huh. Leg. You know, it's like you put it on the ground and it's on the leg. Hey, man, it's versatile. It's what the, the hell are you talking about? Yeah, so you get four of these, and then you got a tennis-themed dining room. You mean coffee table. Or, or coffee table. Coffee table, whatever. this makes more you sense. You get some chairs, too, and put it on the back, right? Like you, this. You, you sit, like this. Can you sit like on this. it? Like this. So you like a chair, like a tennis chair. Yeah. Right. It's fortunately, anyway. Jesus, man, what is wrong with you today? Are you, are you like... and M. <laughs> <laughs> all right let's go uh so i'm gonna take the racket out with coach rob next but yep. uh coach goo where can they find you, you can find me at hu.tennis also be posting content there as well a uh, coach yeah i've been the one day uh... you can find me at cv chen tennis and that's it <laughs> okay shout out to the kanto fans huh let's do it <laughs> hong kong baby let's go all the way all right so let's take it out to coach rob now All right, guys, so we just got off the court with the new Wilson Pro Staff 10.8 version six of one. a 6.1. Six 6.1. One. Six one. Six one. I keep forgetting 6.1. So this is the lighter version of the 100, the non-X. Um, Coach Rob is waving it around and looking at me really hard, like, I'm ready to go. Yeah, let's go. Okay, let's go. This this felt really good, um, whether it was just that it was a little bit lighter. I got the racket head through a little bit faster. Um, it felt really good. I, I enjoyed the uh, the six one. kind of reminded me of back in the old days, um, using the six one And, um, yeah, the 100 head size um, didn't – probably maybe kind of blade-like, but – Mm -hmm. um, I'm really happy they brought this out because this is really good. This is a good stick. Yeah, it, it, it has a little more feel than the Blade 100 to me, I think. Um, maybe a little more bend in the right place, too. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the finish. I like the uh, the feel of it, um, the ball, the pocketing on it. I found the sweet spot more times. Um, not that I don't find the sweet spot that often, but <laughs> some of my miss hits, um, I knew when I was a little off center, but this, I was right 
felt like it was pretty good even when I was a little bit off center um, mm. trying to hang with Jared. <laughs> Coach Jared. <laughs> Let's yeah, go. <laughs> so I think on my end, um, so this is the only racket I think out of the new line that Wilson had that has the glossy finish. The uh, pro staffs have the semi-gloss, and I don't know if it's a placebo thing or not, but I think the glossy finish definitely gives more feel than the other rackets. Um, so I used to use the 6195 18 by 20 um, probably around 15 or 16. That was very good in the sense that that's a player's racket, but the problem was it was a 95 square inch head size. So you had to be perfect on every single shot with that frame. Um, I know for a while they definitely discontinued the 6195 mm -hmm. for a bit and started bringing back some other frames. And I think the 6100, um, this frame, is uh, everything that I was looking for <laughs> when I was younger. So I think I always thought the 6-1 would always be great with a 16 by 19 string pattern. Um, they just never made it at the time. And I think the fact that a 16-19 string pattern is paired with the player style um, kind of layout of the 6 95 is just a perfect match. And for me, I just enjoyed it. Um, again, you don't think it's a 100 square inch head size racket and everything was just responsive and, and good for me. Um, but yeah, I think Wilson's just been doing a great job with all these frames lately and another winner for me. All right. I agree. Even at the 10-8 stock weight, the balance is perfect. The flex is perfect. The feel of the gloss is perfect for me. I like the gloss a lot too. Um, is this leather, guys? I'd say yes. Feel it again. It's not. It's <laughs> not leather. Harry got me. Harry got me. It's not leather. <laughs> it ain't leather. It's we leather. Before I did. Remember pleather? <laughs> There used to be a word back in the day. It means false leather. Leather. <laughs> so, uh, got me on that one. False leather. Okay. It looks like leather. Doesn't it look like yeah. leather? But it, it, it's got a tackier feel. Um, but yeah, good racket overall. Thank you for making this racket. Um, thank you, Wilson. If you're a blade user and you want a slightly bigger head, or if you're a, man, a hundred kind of a, ultra user burn user and you want just a little more control and a little more flex and a little more feel this is the one it's got a i mean it, it's as predictable as you're gonna get with this type of a racket um you know when you hit a good shot you know when you hit a bad shot you know how deep you're gonna hit it you know when you missed it okay because you'll feel it <laughs> yep. all right agree Coach Jared, since you got the mic, where can I find you, bud? You guys can find me on Instagram at Ma Tennis. Perfect. Thank you, Coach Rob. Here, here, here. I know, I know, <laughs> I know. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Coach Good, check yeah. this out. Swing Vision got new commercial out. Oh. Check out his James Blake right. and Ronick! Oh my god! He's still playing? I mean, he's still playing. Whoa! Whoa! What? Dude, dude. That's damn fast. I can do it. I can do it, dude. Back in the day, I could, I could do that. I could totally do that, dude. You can do that. You can do that. Let's go, man. We can show him how it's done. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All Let's right. Go. All right. All right. 85 miles per hour. That can't be right. No, that's definitely right. That's definitely right, man. 88 miles per hour. That's not a gigawatt. One more, one more. Watch me, watch me. 78 miles per hour. Hey, man. <laughs> Something wrong with this program. Nah, that's just you, bro. L you try, you try. Right, Let's okay, see what I'll you do. It. I'll do it. You're gonna go 69 right here. 127 miles per hour. You can check out your serve speed on Swing Vision 2. Doc, we got an issue.